All right, well, this is the second video of uh, John Bedini's uh, zero-force motor, and I'm calling it the type lid motor. Um, I took the other video down because I made some statements that just weren't accurate, and uh, I took a look at it a little closer to the situation, and uh, it isn't exactly what I thought, um, but I, I went one step further and put this on a solid-state circuit, and change the configuration around. And this is a Bedini SSG circuit. It's a schoolgirl, a modified school, simplified schoolgirl without the uh, energy recovery diode and such. And uh, this is why I'm posting the video. Something's going on here, folks. Uh, the uh, neodymium magnet is north south. Uh, on the outside face and the magnet runs on the edge of the coil instead of up on the top which is where you'd normally run a, an SSG coil and then uh, I've got a load on it here and this is my little friend Maggie that uh, is the load and uh, the neodymium magnet there is rotating the magnet in uh, Maggie's mouth and that's my load at that. Now this is not accurate. Um, I don't know how I'm going to test this exactly because the dynamic of this is not what I thought. This is inducing a current back into the coil. I ran some tests and when you rotate a magnet in that fashion with the coils of wire in that configuration you are inducing a current backwards. I just don't know how it's, it's, it's doing it. Um, but it, it is not just strictly no counter EMF on this particular configuration. But when I saw that, I just thought I'd better do another video because I wasn't going to post anything at all when I figured out that it wasn't what I was saying it was. But uh, anyway, it's an it's an interesting enough situation that uh, you should take a look at this and come to your own conclusions. John's calling it a zero force motor. Um, my particular configuration is uh, much different than what he shows and I'm running it on a standard SSG circuit. Uh, it's a bifiler coil, um, air core coil. But anyway, this is just something I wanted to share and I'm sorry I had to take the other video down but that video I made some statements that just weren't accurate so uh, I went ahead and pulled it, and then I'm posting this one instead. And you guys come to your own conclusions. Um, go take a look at his video and see what you think. Uh, this is just my uh, rendition of it at this point. Thanks for watching.